In Section 1, Context for Teaching and Learning, you will have multiple assignments to complete. Let's take a look at one of the assignments, Observation, Reflection, and Write-Up. The Observation, Reflection, and Write-Up. The purpose of the observation is to help increase consciousness of classroom practice and tools, resources, and ideas that may be useful and available to you. If you are unable to observe another teacher, you may video yourself teaching and reflect on your own practice. There is no time requirement for the observation. The following bullets clearly state the intent of the pre-observation, the observation notes, and the post-observation. The assignment is posted at the bottom of the block in the orange writing. We'll want to click on Observation, Reflection, and Write-Up. Once you get to this block, you'll want to click on it again for it to download onto your computer. Once it is downloaded, open up the assignment. You will type directly into this assignment the school where the observation occurred, the class, the subject, and the date. Your observation reflection, you are thinking about what you're looking for and why. What do you hope to get out of the observation? What are your areas of need? What do you want to take back to your classroom? A minimum of five bullets is expected. In the middle section, you will complete your observation notes. This can be a bullet format, a paragraph format, but basically you want to write what you see and what you hear. These are observational notes. The post-observation reflection, a minimum of five bullet requirement, you're thinking about what you plan to implement in your own classroom. If you happen to not see anything you want to implement, why? What could you still do with what you saw? What could you learn from it? There should be connections to the pre-observation reflection and your observation notes. How will you apply what you observed and what you learned into your practice? Please explain. Once you've completed the assignment, you will want to save it and then you will want to click on the hand in button. Choose the file and upload into the Haiku account. Once it is handed in, a green check will appear next to the hand in button. You can always go back to the opposite and ref reflection and write up block and you can go to the Dropbox and you can take a look and see what you have handed in or have not handed in as well. To get back to the main class, you want to click on Pages, and it will take you back to the section that you were just in.